All right, let's do this. Are we done? We are done. We are ready to go. There is nothing else I could possibly need to bring with me other than this. Power is probably pretty important, so let's bring that. <laughs> um, also, oxygen tanks. I have to take a close look at that because if I run out of oxygen, I'm dead. So, yeah. I'm pretty sure we have everything required. All right, so let's be 100% sure. This is our fueling setup. We have coal generator, a coal generator that will power a fuel loader, both of which we have in here. All right, we're not gonna need a refinery because we're gonna bring actual fuel with us. That is eight buckets worth of fuel. That is a lot of fuel, considering I think one can fuel a rocket. So we are more than good. So in that case, um, <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, I just wasted so much oil. Whoopsies. <laughs> I just clicked on it the wrong way. Whoops. Oh, I just wasted so much oil. And, and that's fine. We get tons of it anyway. Ah, dying inside. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to wait until it reaches 8,000 so we know we have 8 buckets worth. Oh my god. <laughs> Here we go. Yeah, it's 8,000 and something. Might be 80. I don't remember. It's like 10, 20 something per bucket. Anyway, I think that's good. Boom. It has fuel in it. Lots and lots. I have to keep in mind, all the space equipment is going in here. So we have all of this with us. We are freaking ready. Here we go, guys. Oh my god. This is gonna be amazing. Off into space we go! A hundred percent! Here we go! Five, four, three, two, one, lift off! Ah! And there we freaking go. Out into space. Goodbye, village. Goodbye, lack of a home. Goodbye, mountains. And goodbye, Earth. Things are getting more and more quiet as we go up. The atmosphere becomes thinner as sound waves have a difficult time, a more difficult time passing. Okay, this is getting really... Up, oh, and it's back. <laughs> oh my god. This is freaking scary. There's the waypoints. Stronghold. Look at that. Look at the distance, right? Home. The waffle is a thousand meters. Uh, okay, I'm now a thousand meters in the air right now. Boom. And we are out. Oh my god. Alright, well, what the hell is that? I don't even want to know. Alright, this is where we are now. A space station can be created here. Huh. Well, I don't have the materials for space station, so let's go. I wanna. I'm gonna go in here. Here we go. We're going to the moon. Launch. Oh. 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 Okay. 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 We gotta slow down. All right. What's our Y coordinate right now? We are at Y 600. All right, I think I can, I, I don't need to hold space. Okay, we're dropping fast. Oh, that is the moon. That is the moon, everybody. Oh my God. We're finally doing it. After all this time. Uh oh. We did it. We freaking did it. 
We're on the moon! Woo! We did it! Oh my god! I am so mobile! Oh, this is cool. Here's our lander. And you can see that we have fuel. And we have our rocket. So that's a thing. Oh my god, it's dark. Oh my god, it's dark. You know what? I did bring glowstone for crafting, but I could use it for light. That would actually be very smart. So you know what? Uh, I'm going to take half of it. Make it in the blocks. And we're going to do this. Oh my god, this is cool. We're here. After all this time, we made it to the moon. There we go. All right. Now, the launch site is pretty visible. No, it's not. All right, so I'm going to make a waypoint then. Let's do that. J, waypoint, new, uh, drop down. And I'm going to name it the drop point. Close. All right, now I saw that there was a villager, or a village over there. So let's do it. Also, bows and arrows are probably way straighter. Oh, oh my god. Yeah, look at that. There's not as much air drop either. Boom, you're dead. Oh my god. All right, let's go to the, um, it's so quiet. I'm actually going to turn the volume up a little bit. There we go. Oh my god. <laughs> so as you can see, we have a bunch of evolved enemies including the evolved zombie they have a lot of health and they have oxygen masks on so they don't die in these uh, harsh conditions oh my god look at this evolved enderman i'm not i'm not touching that all right so th there are somehow crops out here i remember this and there's alien villagers what's that noise I got hello, alien villager. I'll need to equip a frequency module to communicate with them. Wait, but I have one. I have one. Game. There we go. Whoa. Lunar sapphires for an oxygen mask. Whoa. You can partially. He can give me fuel? Whoa. I can make a moon buggy. I can make a tier 2 rocket. Compressed copper. Tin. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> This guy really likes... Oh my god, you have some valuable trades. Jungle saplings can be... Jungle saplings can be traded for those lunar crystals. I'm probably going to be able to find them. What are these torches? Glowstone torches. How do you make a glowstone torch? How do you make that? Oh. Oh, whoops. The glowstone I... Eh. The glowstone I put down at the spawn there wasn't really the smartest of moves, was I? Or was it? Alright. Okay. Now, look at our oxygen supply. We're about... We're about a f an eighth of the way through it all. So, that's a thing. Also, can trees grow out here? Because if they can, that's going to mean a lot. The guy wants jungle saplings, so let's, um, hold up. We gotta find skeletons. These guys make such weird noises. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Whoops. Um, hi, skeleton. Oh, I missed. You're lucky. Oh, <laughs> I'm gonna use these. I need lunar sapphires, though. Like, why? 
Can I grow trees out here? Because if I can, next time I come, I am bringing jungle saplings with me. Unless there are jungle saplings here. But I kind of doubt it because, you know, no oxygen, so trees are going to have a hard time. Let's see. Uh, let's do... Ah, look at that. Hi. Alright, so trees can grow on the moon. That is valuable information. So now, let us go mining. Uh, I'm actually going to use the FLNs because they are awesome. Uh, it's in here, probably. Yep, it is. Alright, sweet. Probably going to want to get a backpack, turn on the magnet, and let's go. <laughs> I cannot see right now. <laughs> Alright, I'm getting ores. I got a cheese curd. Oh. There we go. I can see now. Also, those are lunar crystals. Thank you very much. Oh, they're lunar sapphires. I'm sorry. Oh, this is so cool. Lunar sapphire. <laughs> okay. The triple jump is really OP. See how awesome it is that I can... I am such an efficient traveler with this amount of gear. And there's bedrock. Alright. Look at that. All oh, this moon rock. Is there a use for moon rock? There's gotta be a use for... Oh, it can be used like stone, kind of, maybe. It makes furnaces, at least. Alright, can I use a furnace to turn it back into cobble? That'd be nice. Probably not. Yeah, probably not. I don't know what the hell that is. Okay, so it appears I'm going to get a lot of moon rock. So I'm going to separate the moon rock from everything else. <laughs> Ugh, hiccups, man. Alright, that's all moon rock. I'm going to put that in the front slot. And then everything else goes in here. Alright. We've reached the bottom. So now we should go there. Oh, there's a creeper that was just in there. Oh. Ooh, yes. Sapphire ore. I like that. Okay, we found a cave. That's a thing. Oh. It's weird how the hip detection for this moon rock is... I got a Winston mini head. What, you think I'm stranded out here? Nah, I ain't stranded. I can go back anytime I want. A lot of copper and tin. I don't need that. This I need. Yes. Yes, yes. I can also buy an oxygen tank. I don't know if it's full or not, but I can. Oh, this is cool. And we get to go down to the bottom. More of these. Thank you very much. We're going to need the tier 2 workbench. That's for sure. That's how we're going to get to other planets. So, the thing about space astronomy is that there are tons of planets to explore. I'm, I'm just exploring the moon because it's the only thing I know about Galacticraft. But there is so much more. It's going to be ridiculous. Also, there's probably another cave above me or below me because I see a lot of mobs. Okay, maybe not. Maybe it's below. I should go right where I see the hostile thing. And then go up. And down. Well, nuclear option. Boom! Ooh. It's moon dirt. Doesn't sound like dirt when I break it. Also, that's a lot of stuff. Nah. So far, I have six crystals from the undergrounds. Right, let's go down now because I don't think... I don't know. Oh, there's a cave. 
Oh oh. Oh oh. Oh oh. <gasps> oh my god. Those are charged evolved creepers. How about no? I don't want to have anything to do with that. Those are some shenanigans right there. I do not know. No, 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 no. Well, I found this cave at least. Or is this connected to my cave? No, it's not. Well, now it is because I connected it, but you know what I mean. These things are freaking hard to find, these crystals. I'm back. Also, I probably shouldn't have been in game when I was talking on the phone. That was not smart because I lost some oxygen. I probably should have paused the game like a smart person, but I didn't. Uh, yeah, that's it. <laughs> It's a little bit of a problem. Oh, hi, Creeper. You're trying to sneak up on me. I don't think so. Also, I have knockback so that you can't do that. Ha ha ta pa. Goodbye. <laughs> so, my goal for this trip is, I guess, to get enough lunar sapphires to, um, to get a tier 2 rocket schematic from that uh, villager guy. And then, I, I know for a fact, there are dungeons on the moon, and I'd like to find one. I, the only thing is I don't know where I'm going to find him. All right, so let's get out of here. I'm going to go back up to the surface. I've learned a valuable lesson. Wasting EFL lens on the moon is not something I need to be doing, so I'm not going to do that. <laughs> uh, that's nine lunar sapphires I've collected so far. I'm probably not going to have enough to buy the thing I want. We will see. I'm glad I have this powerful bulb because... These things are usually pretty tough to kill. The uh, evolved everything. Okay. I'm at Y40. I'm gonna have to go up a little bit. Yeah, I'll use the ones. <laughs> I just blasted my way <laughs> up and through. All right, let's see. Um, Hi, alien villager. That's a tier two. Wait, I need to get something else. Oh, so I need to buy the moon buggy one for... Wait a minute. Oh, he converts between them. Oh. That's different. He can give me a battery. I don't have batteries. I don't even know how to make batteries. So that, that's a good deal in my book. Yeah, I'll take a battery. Oxygen tank, oxygen gear, partially filled fuel canister. I like that, but I don't know how to get fuel in the fuel canister. You know, I'm going to do it. Good. All right. Uses. Yeah. All right, sweet. So we got a fuel canister. Okay. Can you stop jittering? Game. Stop it. There you go. Alright, my goal now... <gasps> Space Coconut! Space Coconut! Ah! Meteoric Iron! Ah, that, that's fun. That's always fun. And now I'm flying. I wonder if the elytra works. It does, somehow. Which is weird, because there's no air. So you'd imagine... Okay, pants. Stop! Jesus. Now, dungeons are pretty visible from the surface, so I should be able to find one. Oh, there's my launch site. Oh, and that's the thing I dug, I think. Maybe it's not. I don't know. What is that? Nope, this is definitely me. Wee! Ow. Sure you want to do that, skeleton? Not a good idea. Alright, let's find a dungeon... So I'm stupid. Um, you can convert between the buggy and the tier 2 rocket schematics in the villager crafting menu. You can't buy them like I thought. So, whatever. Now, I'm pretty sure these dungeons... Are, there's a lot of villages around here. And when I have this kind of mobility, it's pretty cool that I can just fly around space. Alright, I'm back. Sorry about that. Um, so, good news. I... um. I assume this would happen because MC Pro Hosting is a good company and they have good business standards and whatnot. But um, earlier today when I started recording in this recording session, 
I said that Subiacraft got mysteriously rolled back almost a year for seemingly no reason. And luckily, um, turns out they do weekly backups. So we hopefully should be back online with the most current version. I mean, I didn't make any substantial changes in the past week. So we should be fine. There might be a little bit of Let's Play progress that's lost. But other than that, that's pretty good. I mean, I can't complain about the one thing that I might have lost. And that's like changing up the spawn for Christmas. Because Christmas passed. So, whatever. Anyway, yeah. So, that saga has been completed. We don't have to worry. Subiocraft shall be up and running as it was. And I'm going to start doing monthly backups now. Because apparently, stuff like this happens. And oh boy, would I not like if that actually... That's good, that's good, that's good. Ah! Interruptions. Constant interruptions. <laughs> I'm actually in contact with the uh, MC Pro hosting staff right now, so... I'm in and out of recording. Okay. There we go. So... Uh... I don't know where I'm gonna find this dungeon, because... Last I checked, they were... The dungeons are not that hard to find from what I remember, but I don't know. Usually they're accessible from the surface, but obviously not right now. Oh, I haven't been record- or I, I have been recording. I haven't been timing this episode. Whoops. <laughs> well, it's been 30 minutes, but that's through all the phone calls and the stuff I've been doing. So, I, I want to find this dungeon, man. Probably near where I started. Nope. Not gonna find it here. I wish I had a way to look through blocks. That'd be pretty sweet. Like an x-ray goggle or something. Ooh, that might be a thing. Hold on. I wish I had the yeah, x-ray. Ooh, what is that? Oh, it's just deco craft. Just visually thing visual things. Not necessarily something I could need or use. Hmm, I gotta get this dungeon some I know there's dungeons on the moon. That's the whole point of this entire planet is that dungeon because the there's a boss and then there's loot and that loot is the tier two thing or buggy. I think it's either one of them. And if you don't like what you get, then you can actually swap them out of the village. So that's good. It's good. Uh I gotta find I gotta find it. I find a dungeon. Maybe this could show me where I need to go. Huh? That goes real far down, all the way to bedrock. In fact, what the heck is that? At least my jumping can just launch me up. <laughs> Look at that! I don't even need to use my teleportation step to just fly up. It's pretty freaking cool. The lack of gravity makes this a very easy to traverse area. I seriously need to get out of here, though. Ah, oh, This is not where I want it to be. Maybe there's a dungeon finder. Hold on. Dungeon. Dungeon keys. I know those are a thing. Tier 10. Oh, my God. Glass. Dungeon glass. Dungeon locator. Wait a minute. <laughs> oh, this is so cheatsy. Look at this. Okay. Dungeon locator. Creative only, right? But look what happens when I change directions. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Well, guess what? We have ourselves access to a compass that shows us where dungeons are. And you're not supposed to get it until creative mode. Oh. Oh, get wrecked. You're just hurting yourself, buddy. Goodbye. Now I need to go to the surface because now I have a way. Also, wait, is that fire? I'm on the moon. That's fire on the moon. Mm-hmm. Galacticraft have some work. They have some work to do. Alright, dungeon locator, 
Show me where to go. Oh my god, look at that. Blip. Alright, here we go. It's gonna start elytra flying, and then I'm just gonna watch. As I go this way. There we go. Now we wait. <laughs> Moon dirt. Oh! Oh! We found one. <laughs> I love exploiting games. See, the thing is, I'm just... I'm good at breaking games. That's just all I got. Oh, boy. Okay, this is a topic for the next episode. So leave a like down below if you guys enjoyed this episode. And that's Harry so far. Oh, you guys probably hate me for that. <laughs> all right, in the next one, we are going to explore this moon dungeon. Ooh, I'm able to get the blocks. I thought you couldn't break the blocks, but I was wrong. All right, well, anyway, that's it. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys later.